Another fresh church advisory was out on Thursday. The bishop has issued advisory to the faithful, stating strictly not to attend masses or visit the church if not necessary. All children and elders above the age of 60 should refrain from visiting the church and gatherings. Even no gatherings for funerals or marriages, here's more. On Thursday, the bishop issued an advisory appealing all the people not to attend mass unless strictly necessary. And if attending, then one should keep one meter distance from each other. Also, all children and elders above the age of 60 with or without cough, cold, fever or serious ailments including diabetes should refrain from going to church. All baptism and marriages should be attended and celebrated with only the family, no visitors for deaths, or else postpone other celebrations. These instructions are necessitated by the fact that the virus spreads in the most tuples, unexpecting the rapid manner. And here are some of do's and don'ts. Celebration of Holy Mass 1. The faithfuls are advised not to go for daily Mass unless it is strictly necessary. They should, or in case, keep a distance of not less than one meter from each other. 2. Strongly advised not to take part in Mass are the children and those above the age of 60 age, and those who are under a bout of even common cold including cough, sneezing, running, nose or fever, or those having coexisting ailments like hypertension, diabetes, heart issues, lung disease, cancer, etc. D. And those who have traveled from or any of the virus affected areas outside or inside the country after the 1st March 2020. The priest, however, should continue to celebrate Mass even without any consecration. The Sacrament of Anointing the Sick and Vatican. The priests are not to deny the sacrament of anointing the sick whenever requested. However, the priest should sanitize his hands before and after touching the recipient and take other precautionary measures. Sacrament of Baptism Baptisms are to be celebrated taking the necessary sanitary precautions and with the participation of close family members only provided they do not show the symptoms of the disease or having a common cold. In case they are or even the godparent show such symptoms, then they should not participate the celebration. For marriage, marriage celebrations with large attendance should be postponed to a safer time. Funerals Funerals are to be celebrated only with the participation of the minister and the close family members who are to take the necessary precautions. 2. On the occasion of death, gatherings in the house of the deceased are to be avoided. Masses for the death and participation of the large congregation are to be rescheduled to a safer time. It's a Goa 365 Bureau report.